God's love for us offers us the sense of belonging and identity we all crave. Our Daily Bread Today's encouragement from the Our Daily Bread devotional was written by Tim Gustafson. Tim writes, I'd been out late the night before, just as I was every Saturday night. Just 20 years old, I was running from God as fast as I could. But suddenly, strangely, I felt compelled to attend the church my dad pastored. I put on my faded jeans, well-worn t-shirt, and unlaced high tops, and drove across town. You know, I don't recall the sermon Dad preached that day, but I can't forget how delighted he was to see me. With his arm over my shoulder, he introduced me to everyone he saw. This is my son, he proudly declared. His joy became a picture of God's love that has stuck with me all these decades. The imagery of God as loving Father occurs throughout the Bible. In Isaiah 44, the prophet interrupts a series of warnings to proclaim God's message of family love. Dear Israel, my chosen one, he said, I will pour out my spirit on your descendants and my blessing on your children. Isaiah noted how the response of those descendants would demonstrate family pride. Some will proudly claim, I belong to the Lord, he wrote. Some will write the Lord's name on their hands. We were to Israel belong to God, just as I belong to my adoptive father. Nothing I could do would ever make him lose his love for me. He gave me a glimpse of our Heavenly Father's love for us. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Isaiah chapter 44, verses 1 through 5. But now listen, Jacob, my servant, Israel, whom I have chosen. This is what the Lord says. He who made you, who formed you in the womb, and who will help you. Do not be afraid, Jacob, my servant, Jeshurun, whom I have chosen. For I will pour water on the thirsty land, and streams on the dry ground. I will pour out my spirit on your offspring, and my blessing on your descendants. They will spring up like grass in a meadow, like poplar trees by flowing streams. Some will say, I belong to the Lord. Others will call themselves by the name of Jacob. Still others will write on their hand, the Lord's, and will take the name Israel. That's today's scripture reading from Isaiah, chapter 44, verses 1 through 5. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we all come from families that are broken in one way or another. Thank you for loving us in that brokenness and for showing us what real love looks like. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.